Words of its own secret document create problems, then offer solutions. In 1986, uh, someone bought an IBM copier at a second-hand sale. And when they got it home, they found inside a very thick document, which obviously shouldn't have been there, called Quiet Weapons, uh, or rather Silent Weapons for a Quiet War. And this described a policy of mass public mind control that has been orchestrated on the people of the world, particularly the Western world, since the 1950s. See if, I'll just read you a little bit of it, see if you recognize the world this document is describing. Experience has proven that the simplest method of securing a silent weapon and gaining control of the public is to keep the public undisciplined and ignorant of basic systems principles on the one hand, while keeping them confused, disorganized and distracted with matters of no real importance on the other hand. This is achieved by, one, disengaging their minds, sabotaging their mental activities, providing a low quality program of education in mathematics, logic, systems design and economics, and discouraging technical creativity. Two, engaging their emotions, increasing their self-indulgence and their indulgence in emotional and physical activities by A, unrelenting emotional affrontations and attacks, brackets, mental and emotional rape, by way of a constant barrage of sex, violence and wars in the media, especially the TV and the newspapers. B, giving them what they desire, in excess, junk food for thought, and depriving them of what they really need. Three, rewriting history and law, and subjecting public opinion to the deviant creation, which I take to mean, don't tell them who they really are. Thus being able to shift their thinking from personal needs to highly fabricated outside priorities. These preclude their interest in and discovery of the silent weapons of social automation technology. The general rule, it says, is that there is profit in confusion. The more confusion, the more profit. Therefore, the best approach is to create problems and then offer solutions. Diversion summary. Media. Keep the adult public attention diverted away from real social issues and captivated by matters of no real importance. Does that describe our media today or what? Schools. Keep the young public ignorant of real mathematics, real economics, real law and real history. Entertainment. Keep the public entertainment below a sixth grade level. Work. Keep the public busy, busy, busy with no time to think back on the farm with the other animals.